Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. Windows 10 optional update KB5004296 is now rolling out for Windows 10 versions 21H1, 20H2 and 2004. It started rolling out yesterday on the 29th of July 2021 and I received my update in my part of the world this morning on the 30th. Now KB5004296 is an optional update so it won't be downloaded and installed automatically and you don't have to install this update as it's an optional update and it's a preview update and these normally roll out near the end of every month. Now this is an important update as, as mentioned in previous videos. This addresses and fixes finally according to Microsoft those ongoing nagging important gaming issues that many um, of you have been experiencing and those are with the you know frame rate issues and rendering issues um, on your uh, GPU and obviously your reduced frame rates and this hasn't been an ongoing issue um, since March and April of this year 2021 and according to Microsoft this latest optional update finally addresses those gaming issues so if you have been experiencing any problems while gaming frame rates rendering issues and so on go download this optional update and install it. As Microsoft says, those um, uh, issues now are finally fixed and patched with this latest update. And if you don't download this update now, all the bug fixes and fixes will appear uh, in the next uh, Patch Tuesday cumulative update, which is the second Tuesday next month of August 2021. Now, as mentioned, this is rolling out for Windows 10 versions 21H1, 20H2, and also 2004 and if you're on 21H1 your OS build now will be 19043.1151 if you're on 20H2 it'll be 19042 and 2004 you will be on 19041 the point release stays exactly the same for all of those versions now as always if you'd like to see if you have the update just head to your settings menu update and security and as mentioned this is an optional update so you will have to check for updates and once it appears then you have the option to download and install the update now if you are completely happy with your windows 10 operating system currently you have no bugs you have no gaming issues you have no printing problems you have no no issues on windows 10 then you don't have to install this update only install this update if you have been having issues with windows 10 and as mentioned if you don't install it now a lot of these fixes will appear in next month's compulsory automatic mandatory patch tuesday update now to see if you have the update or if you've installed the update you just go to view update history and because it's a um a, a optional update it won't appear under quality updates you have to go right down to the bottom and it'll be under other updates and here it is cumulative update preview for windows 10 version 21 h1 kb 5004 Two nine six, and that's the update you will need now to address uh, those gaming issues and another issue that uh, this update fixes is if we go back to our legacy control panel and i have posted a video on this previously and we go to power options and you can also get to this in your uh, your windows settings uh, menu the app and this addresses now the uh, bug that was affecting the power plans in Windows 10 between you know your balanced performance and if you have high performance as well and the, the, this wasn't working properly on certain configurations and this was caused due to previous updates and now Microsoft also says that that issue has also now been addressed patched and fixed with this latest update and this was also affecting game uh, gamers with um, and causing gaming issues as well so this update apparently fixes your power plan options and problems as well. And then it also apparently removes support for the Windows timeline uh, sync ability across your different devices. So your timeline now, up until this update, which rolled out yesterday, uh, your timeline now with this update is no longer synced between your different devices. I have nothing in my timeline because I like to keep this clear. So um, it will still appear on your, um, your local machine, but you won't have the option now to sync between your different devices, your recent documents and so on on your Windows timeline. And then some other important uh, fixes it brings to uh, uh, Windows 10. And I'm just gonna read these quickly from the change log in the Microsoft support webpage. 
it updates an issue that plays the sound for selecting something in a game loudly when you press the trigger button on a game controller. So that's just another gaming issue that's been fixed. And as mentioned, it updates an issue that prevents power plans and game mode from working as expected. This results in lower frame rates and reduced performance while gaming. And that's the big one for this update. And it updates an issue that fails to detect that you are connected to the internet after you connect to a virtual private network or VPN for short. And it also updates uh, an issue that causes printing to stop or prints the wrong output. This issue occurs when you print using a USB connection after updating to Windows 10 version 2004 or later. And that's also been an ongoing major problem since around about March or April of this year. And now according to Microsoft, this optional update um, KB5004296 now addresses any remaining printer issues as well. And then there are numerous bug fixes that uh, the uh, KB5004296 also brings now with this latest update. Too many to mention here. But as I say, said earlier, if you have been experiencing any bug issues or any problems with Windows 10, download this uh, update because also, it, you know, over and above those uh, power plan and gaming issues and printer issues, it also addresses now a lot of bug issues in Windows 10. So I hope you found this video useful. Once again, thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.